Hello everyone out there. I'm Meredith and I'm with the part of the nightly Brahma Kumaris in Miami Facebook meditation team. And we invite you five nights a week, Monday through Friday, to meditate with us and really just think more deeply about how you can bring more peace and benevolence and joy into your lives. So here we are tonight and if you're meditating with me now, we'll meditate in a couple of next couple of minutes. And you know someone that you think, well, maybe they could use some meditation, they could use uh, a little bit of peace, then share or ask them to join you. And our whole idea is just getting more and more people meditating here in South Florida or wherever, anywhere you might be in the world. And that's how we feel that the world is going to change. And we actually see it happening in so many different ways. So tonight my topic is staying stable. And you know, it's easy to be stable when everything is going your way, right? You wake up, it's a beautiful day, everything works, life is good. The reality, life is not exactly like that these days. We wake up, someone just recently told me they get wake up and they're depressed. I was listening to some other uh, women talking about that they were meditating and uh, they said I asked them I said why are you meditating why are you did you start meditating they're listening to some of these apps and one said I don't sleep at night so I thought I would try meditation another one said uh, I you know there's so much anxiety in me about what's happening with my children and going to school and and virtual learning and everything she said that I thought well I would try meditation so, you know, this word meditation is out there. It's out there and people know that it's time to access it. So that's why we're here tonight. And again, the topic is staying stable. And I wanna just add at the end of that, uh, no matter what's going on in your life, you can be stable. And again, you're thinking, how is that? You know, how can that be? Well, I think that the trick is it's all about going within and realizing that you can be in control of those anxious, the anxiety, you can be in control of the fears and everything by just going within and accessing who you truly are. So here we are, we're gonna start right now, let's get to it. Just looking for the music right now. I had it set up and uh, it sort of disappeared here, but here it is, it's back. No anxiety, right? So let me now just take some me time, right? Me time is time for myself. Time to do the things that I need to do to truly feel stable in my life, to feel solid, to feel strong, to feel good about whatever is happening. I don't need to be affected by everything that's happening around me. I don't need to be upset by someone else. Someone, often it's what someone says to me. It's how someone makes me feel. And in a second, I'm just gone. I suddenly lose that feeling of strength. It's almost like a weak feeling that comes over me when I get hurt by someone or someone makes me fearful or so, of anything. So again, all I have to do is just go within to my true self, the self that I really am, the soul, the energy, located in the center of the forehead right here, the energy, the light, the spirit, the non-physical part of me that is eternal. That's who I truly am. Let me focus on that inner light, that beautiful, sparkling light within me that is just waiting to be accessed and waiting for me to connect with so that I can be stable and I can be good no matter what it is that might be affecting me in my life. So let me just focus on this inner light right now. Calmness sets in. A feeling of just peace, a feeling of everything is fine. Everything is fine in my life. It all begins with how I think. 
let me just think in powerful, positive ways. Let me think to myself, I am beautiful. I'm a beautiful being. I'm a good being. I'm a being of light. I'm a feeling of a being that's filled with goodness. I can give up those thoughts, those negative thoughts about myself, those thoughts where I think I'm no good, I'm not good enough in the world, I'm not doing enough, I'm not successful enough. Forget that. Forget any thoughts that aren't generative. Give up any thoughts where you feel, where I'm feeling that I'm weak or I'm not strong. I am strong. Let me repeat that right now. I am a being of light that's strong, that's stable, that knows who I am. I am a being of light who is so special and so unique. That is who I am. There is no one in this entire world that's quite like me. There's no one who is me. I am the only one who thinks exactly like I do, who feels exactly like I do, who lives exactly like I do. Others are similar, everyone's similar. We're all connected. We are all the same in that we are all spirit. We're all energy. But let me just embrace this idea that I am unique. Let me get in touch with my uniqueness, my inner beauty. Let me just resonate with this idea that I am a wonderful being, a being of light, a being of love. And let me enjoy this moment, this beautiful moment that I can have just with myself. No need to go out there for something in life. No need to ask for anything or to even feel that if I just had this or I just had that, I would be okay because when I get this or I get that, I'm okay for the moment, for the second, and then that feeling goes away because I can't hold on to the physical things or the material things. And I can't depend upon any of those things to bring happiness to me and to bring inner strength to me. I can't even focus or expect anyone else in my life to give me that feeling of peace. All I have to do is just rely on myself. And as I rely or depend upon myself for inner strength and inner peace, I'm able to help others and help others bring peace and bring a sense of well-being into their lives too. No need to change anyone. In fact, it's not even possible to change anyone but myself. I can change. What can I change? I can change myself into something better, into something more joyful, into something more loving. I can be the person that I was born to be, the beautiful, benevolent being, this beautiful being of light, this beautiful being of love. I am capable of changing. I don't have to feel stuck. I don't have to feel hopeless or feel that life isn't working out the way I expected it to. The more that I get in touch with myself as this beautiful, special being, the more life does work out. <coughs> the more life works to support me and to make me into this amazing being 
this being of light and being of love that's here, not just to better myself or to have a better life, but to help others, to help all along the way. Every day, <coughs> excuse me, every day I can wake up and feel the joy of the day. Feel that I am here for a very special reason. I have a purpose. I have a reason to be here. So let me look at myself. Let me look deeper into myself and see what that purpose is. It's not just about my job or my work or my talents or even my family. Those, though all of those things are very important, it's something so much bigger. I'm here to be part of this changing world, part of benevolence, of bringing something so powerful something so positive to the world. I feel so good and I know that as I become more stable and as I become more strong and solid that I can be the one that can help bring about this beautiful change in the world. So all I have to do is change myself. Nothing more. Love myself and as I love myself, I'm loving others. I'm supporting others. I'm accepting others. Everything in my life becomes so beautiful, so special. I thank you for joining me and meditating with me tonight. And I hope you'll be meditating with us, the Brahma Kumaris Miami on Facebook, and also we're on YouTube every night just to be able to experience some positive energy with us and be part of creating this positive energy and to be a being of light and love and peace. Om Shanti.